Where do I even begin? All my friends are gone. I, I don't know why. I mean, they just left me here. And when people finally start looking, when they start caring, you feel ashamed, empty, alone. And then they just stand there, believing in their innocence. James. James. You wrote this? Yeah. Jesus Christ! What? I mean, I don't know what to say. I'm at a loss of words. I'm, I mean, what were you trying to accomplish by having me read this? I don't know. Maybe you could give me some a advice or something? I mean, I'm not an expert on these things. Charlotte, you're, you're her best friend. But look, none of this makes any sense to me. Well, like what? Well, in here, at, at the end, you say, they just stand there believing in their innocence. Like, what does that even mean? Well, they do. Okay, she does. Then why write that they do? Look, I didn't mean to write that. I mean, I, I was just blabbering in there. I was going on a tangent. I, it wasn't. It was a mistake. Okay, I believe you. Sorry, it's... My, my mind's running crazy right now, you know? Yeah, I, I get it. it. It's just there's all these thoughts running through my head, and I'm, I'm just trying to find a way to express them. Well, it's a good thing you're doing it through that. Yeah. But, um, could you not tell anyone I showed you that? Of course, James. Thanks, cuz, well, you know. Yeah. Thanks. Look, I know how difficult this is for you. <sighs> I mean, it's hard for both of you, you and Chloe. No. No, it's not. Mm -hmm. uh, it's not difficult for her. James! She, she just doesn't understand how much harder it is for me. I mean, look at her. She's just- Did you take your medication this morning? Where did that come from? You were- Yes. Yes, I did. I hope you know that's not allowed here. Oh, I know. I'm sorry, Charlotte. It's... You don't have to worry about me all the time. It's... it's fine. Oh, shit. I promise I won't say anything. Say hi. Hey. How was your morning? Fine, I guess. That's good. What's that? It's nothing. Hi, everyone. I'm sorry I'm late. No, the bell hasn't rung yet, but uh, I should have been here. Uh, yeah. Morning, James. Good morning. Everything go okay this morning? Yep. How's the family? The usual. You sure? Yes, I'm sure. Okay. I saw James. Did you do anything interesting last night? Besides, try to sleep. No. Oh, you, you know there's medication for that, right? Yes, I know. Not that it would do any good. Well, it should help. Not with my family. Oh. Want to hear a funny story? 
Sure. Whatever. Okay, so last night, Jen and I were... <laughs> what? <laughs> Nothing, go on. What is it? Oh my god. No. You done? <laughs> Alright, as I was saying, we're gonna work on our projects from yesterday, get together with your partners, okay, all the supplies, all that fun stuff from the back. No screwing around, I want this done and turned in by the end of the period. We got it? You know what would help? What? Talking to her. No, I, are you crazy? So, uh, do you want uh, me to get some supplies or something? Uh, yeah, yeah, Billy, sure. Uh, sure, okay. Back to what I was saying. She could really use someone right now. She has you. Besides, she wouldn't want me. Why not? Both of you are going through the same thing right now. She would understand. No, she wouldn't. I. I don't want to talk to her. I don't even want to see her. Look, I know you don't like her right now. That's not the point. You know what? Never mind. My mistake. Charlotte. James. What's wrong? No, nothing. Where's Bill? No. Off getting supplies. Still? Yeah. Well, maybe you should help him keep yourself occupied. I, I'm, I'm fine, Charlotte. You don't have to worry about me. I do need to worry about you. I don't want you to have another moment in class again. I didn't have a moment. Then what was it then? It was just, don't you have a project to be working on? James, I'm just trying to look out for you. <laughs> I'm... I'm fine. Please. Just go. I got some supplies. Thanks. Yeah, no problem. You want some gum? Uh, no. Thank you. More for me then. Can you stop that. I just, I... It's, uh, alright, it's okay. Keep breathing. Uh, I heard Charlotte shoot her. Are you sure? You yeah. heard them. Yes, yes. She, she, they had their phones out and they were texting. So what made you snap in there, James? I, I, they were, did you hear them? They all were right, mocking right, me behind be, my back. It's gonna be alright. Alright, just keep breathing. Just... Look, you, you can't be doing that. That binder almost hit Matt in the face. Are you kidding me? That kid's a prick. James, 
All right, listen to me. I'm not gonna send you to the office, okay? I don't want to make things any worse for you than they already are. <laughs> worse? You really think things could get worse? James. Really? Okay, look, I'm gonna tell you something. Not as a teacher, but as a friend. James, when I was younger, my sister hurt herself. It was pretty bad. Um, we couldn't convince her to get help. All right, me, our parents, we tried. But we're not exactly from a upper class family. You can imagine when certain things like pride might have gotten in the way. There's no shame in asking for help, James. It went on for years and... Well, eventually, the stains washed off the bathroom tile and the scars began to fade away. Maybe she figured out that we would comment on them a little less often if she wore long sleeve shirts. What I'm saying, James, is you can hide your scars from the world, but the pain's always going to be there for you. This thing about the present is that it's going to be the past. And the past is dead and it can't hurt you. Look, she got help eventually. One day it became too much, and it always becomes too much, James. She went somewhere and she got help. And it wasn't easy. When she came out, she came out not only like the person she once was, but a better person. Yes, even a happier person. Look, she went to a place called Everett Fields. I keep a brochure on my desk for good luck, and in case any of my students are facing hard times. Would you do me a favor, James, and just look at it? Look, I'm, I'm perfectly fine. I don't need help. I'm perfectly normal. James, none of us are normal. What? I don't need help here. What don't you understand about that? James, there's your first step. You need to admit that you have a problem, and then you can start to make progress. You know you're not the person that you used to be. Oh yeah, who was I? Not who you are now. Look, I'm not trying to aggravate you. I'm just trying to be a good friend. <laughs> Who do you think... What, do you think I'm just some screwed up kid in a school full of assholes? Is that it? No, I think that you're smart, funny, clever. I'm not having any of this. Look, James, I'm not... No, shut up! I'm not telling you... You don't know anything. You have no idea what I'm going through. You're just some... Do you understand all the emotion building up inside of me? The pressure just building makes me want to fucking burst. And then you just stand there trying to turn this into some, fabricate it into something else. You're a goddamn hack. James? Shut up! Mr. Richards, is James okay? Yeah, he'll be all right. I shouldn't talk about it with you. Not, not here, not with you guys. Where is he? He went off somewhere. Don't you have some work to be doing? Excuse me, can I use the, the bathroom? Yeah, all right. Excuse me. Asshole. How does he think he is? James! Oh, hell. Charlotte, it's nothing. 
James, you need to tell us. Would you just leave me alone? We're just here to help you. Guys, I do not need help. I am fine. Then why'd you freak out like that? Oh, will you shut up? I mean, seriously. You three come out here pretending to care. You don't care about me. None of you do. And you two. Running up to me every morning, you're ridiculous. It's always like, oh, hey, James, how was your day? How was your night last night? Really? Well, we're just trying to get your mind off Well, it. you could be a little more subtle. And you, I swear to God, if you showed them those texts... It wasn't just the text, James. You backstabbing bitch! What did you do to her? I didn't do anything. You're lying! You have no right to be looking at that. She would never do something like that. But she did! Look at you, James. All of this. Everything you sent her, everything you wrote about her. All because of some fabricated lies. I'm... I'm not the one lying here. She is. You know that. You... you don't understand. She, you, you don't know what she did, what she, what she did to me. What, what she's done to my family. We trusted you, James. We felt sorry for you, but you never gave us anything in return. And what you did to her? You're sick. We tried to help you, James. You're just too damn cynical. I know you can't. Can't what? You call me wrong? You call me sick? Well, look what you just did to me! Look at me! I am looking! Let's see a vile individual! You can't tell anyone. Please don't. Oh, we will. She's the one who lies! Chloe, is it true? So now you care? Huh? Chloe. Don't Chloe me, Charlotte. Took you this long to realize. Chloe, we're sorry. Sorry? You don't. I can't believe you guys. I mean, we're sorry, truly. You think that's cutting it? Cause no, no it's not. Okay. After all this time, you guys just left me. No, Chloe. And you chose him, a liar over your own friend. He needed help. You remember his panic attacks? Which one? The one where he got sent home from school for punching Matt in the face? Or the one today? You understand? Chloe, I'm so sorry if you think that we left you. Listen to yourself. No, listen. You come crawling back to me on your hands and knees to one of your only friends because she wasn't sad enough. The boy is more sad. Oh, poor James. Unbelievable. Just, is it true?
class today. Uh, nothing, nothing. Just a uh, minor panic attack. Okay. So what about you and Chloe? Are you guys still talking or what? Uh, yes. No, no. I, I mean, no, no, we are not. Oh, that's a shame. You guys used to be really good friends. Yeah, well, you can thank Andrew for that one. Yeah. I miss Andrew. Me too. Me too. My hands are all dry now, so... So go back to class. Yeah, see ya. Please. I just wanted to help. But I wanted it. Take this. Garbage. You said you wanted help. And if this is all I can do, then so be it. Just, just take it. You. How could he? How could you guys just leave me? We didn't know. Didn't know? What kind of friends are you? James. I, I can't explain that. You liar! Everything you wrote! Oh, like you aren't. 
What have you done? What have I done? What have you done? Blaming me? It's all your fault and you know it. No. 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 It's not. It's our fault. What have we done? You were the cause. You were the cause of all of this. Don't deny it. Why'd you give in? Because you forced me. I did no such thing. I didn't mean for any of this to happen. Then why? Why would you do this to me? Why, why would you force me? I didn't know. I didn't know any of this would happen. What me and Andrew did, it eats away at me at every waking moment. <laughs> well, then let's face it. We screwed up. We... <laughs> I just... I'm so sorry, Chloe. And I know that will never be enough. But, but it, it's, it's a start. A start. There will never be another start. Just an end. How couldn't we have known? We're monsters. <laughs> Chloe. Please. James, look, I'm so sorry. Um, it, it's, it's all right. You sure? Yeah, I, I'm fine. I, uh, I actually came here for something. What's that? 